beloved brothers and sisters in Islam, as you know, the night of decree known as Laylatul Qadr is to be looked for within the last 10 nights of the month of Ramadan, more likely within the odd nights from amongst the last 10 nights of the month of Ramadan, more likely to be within the second half, which means we would look at the 27th as well as the 29th. But this does not mean that it is not from the 21st onwards. We ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to grant us this night. A very powerful question asked by Aisha radiallahu anha to Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. And we need to know this because we need to understand and realize the power of this Eve. I'm sure we all know the verses of the Quran that were read this evening in Salatul Witr, where Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, this night of decree is better than 1000 months. So this is why we need to realize and understand the command of Allah is sent down on this night. The instruction of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is sent down on this night. If we were to look at that particular surah, open its meaning and read it, we will come to understand this. So the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam is asked a question. Do you see if I see the night of decree, what dua should I read? What prayer should I make? What supplication should I make? And the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam responded in a hadith which is muttafaq alayhi. Completely simple. He says, say, Allahumma innaka afuun tuhibbul afwa fa'fu anni. Oh Allah, you are most forgiving. You love to forgive, so forgive me. As simple as that. If we achieve forgiveness on this night, subhanallah. The hadith says, Man qama laylat al-qadr imanan wa ihtisaban ghufira lahu ma taqaddama min dhamli. Whoever stands the night in ibadah, the night of Laylatul al-qadr, believing and with conviction and expecting a reward from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, all his previous sins are wiped out. So this is the night of decree. We ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to open our doors. I see there are messages doing their rounds saying, read this 70 times and seven times and do this 20 times and 7,000 and 70,000 angels will be sent to do this and that all that is fabricated. Remember one thing, we should not become excited by fabrications. We should be from amongst those who know what is solid and we should know at the same time, continue worshiping Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Allah will open your doors. And remember the simplest acts of worship, sometimes they are the most powerful. We ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to forgive us on this night. So we may read our Quran, we may engage in salah, we may do as much as we can voluntarily. But at the same time, do not forget to engage in the instruction of Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, constantly calling out Allah throughout this night, Allahumma inna ka'afuun tuhibbul afwa fa'fu anni. Oh Allah, you are most forgiving. You love to forgive, so forgive me. I mean, may Allah forgive us this eve and may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala make us witness the eve. The sad reality, and I need to mention this, is we all think the 27th is the night. It may not have been the 27th this year. It may be, it may not be. We need to look for and search for this particular night. And this is the gift of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for us. So that we do not become from amongst those who worship Allah one night and the rest of the nights we forget him. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala grant us good. Ya Allah, you are the greatest. We rely on you. We cannot blink our eyes without you, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, we have you as our Rabb, Ya Allah. You made us, you created us. We are trying our best to follow you, Ya Allah. Forgive us on this night. Ya Allah, accept every letter that we have read. Accept every fast that we have kept, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, protect us and our children, Ya Allah. Protect our wives and husbands, Ya Allah. Protect our children, our offspring, our brothers, our sisters, Ya Allah. Our parents, Ya Allah, grant us good health and grant us barakah and blessings in everything you have given us, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, we ask you to bless us, Ya Allah. We promise that we will turn towards you, Ya Allah. We will never turn away from you, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, let this be a day when you are happy with us. Ya Allah, we've raised our hands. We've completed the Quran, Ya Allah. We've engaged in acts of worship, Ya Allah. You have blessed us with a beautiful month, Ya Allah. We promise, Ya Allah, we will leave our bad ways and habits. Forgive us, Ya Allah. 
Ya Allah, we will never return to our bad ways and habits. Ya Allah, forgive us, Ya Allah, on this day. Ya Allah, we ask you to grant us goodness in, on this day, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, we ask you to cure us from all the sicknesses we have, Ya Allah. All those who are sick and ill in this community, Ya Allah. Those we know about, those we don't know about, grant them cure through your miracle, Ya Allah. You are the owner of cure, Ya Allah. And cure us all of the diseases we may have that we may know, we may not know, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, we ask you to grant rahmah and mercy to all those who have gone away, who have passed away, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, make their graves gardens from the gardens of paradise, Ya Allah. And help us, Ya Allah, grant us shahada on our tongues when you take us away and make it easy easy for us the day we are buried, Ya Allah. The day we will be left in the graveyards, Ya Allah, with our family members going back, Ya Allah. You keep our deeds with us, Ya Allah, and let there be benefit for us on that day, Ya Allah. You help us, Ya Allah. You make it easy the day the angels ask us questions, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, in the grave, in the darkness of the grave, Ya Allah. You lighten it up, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, we ask you to accept from us every word that we have read, Ya Allah. And we ask you on this day to ease the suffering of every person suffering on the globe, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, every one of us has different things we'd like to ask you tonight, Ya Allah. You know exactly what we want, Ya Allah, grant it to us, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, you know everyone's need without us even uttering it, Ya Allah, grant it to us, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, you know every difficulty that everyone is going through, Ya Allah, create ease in everyone's situation in a way that is befitting to them, Ya Allah. Those in debt, Ya Allah, help them pay back their debts, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, those who are suffering lack of sustenance, Ya Allah, you provide for them. You are the owner of sustenance, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, those who have no barakah in their sustenance, Ya Allah, you bless them, Ya Allah, strengthen them so that they can obey your commands and we can obey your commands too. Strengthen us as well, Ya Allah, and grant us all barakah and blessings in our sustenance, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, protect the women of this ummah, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, help them so they can dress appropriately, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, strengthen them so they can put scarves on their heads, Ya Allah. They can dress with loose clothes, Ya Allah, for your sake, cover their bodies, Ya Allah, and have mercy on them. Open their doors, Ya Allah. Strengthen them, Ya Allah. They are our sisters, Ya Allah. They are your creatures, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, you open their doors, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, safeguard the men folk of this Ummah, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, help the men eradicate their bad habits, Ya Allah. Help them to dress appropriately, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, help all those on drugs to leave that habit, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, we promise you we will not go back to any bad habits we have, Ya Allah. Knowingly, we will not do that, Ya Allah. So help us not to do it, Ya Allah. Strengthen us, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, grant us good company, Ya Allah. Make us from those, Ya Allah, who fulfill our five salah a day for your sake, Ya Allah. You've given us such a blessed month, Ya Allah. We don't know if we're going to see another month like this, Ya Allah. Open our doors, Ya Allah. Help us be regular and steadfast to get up for Salatul Fajr, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, we have read so much salah for you. Accept it from us, Ya Allah. And make it easy for us, Ya Allah, for throughout the year, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, help us to eat halal in this time when we don't even know sometimes what is halal and haram. Ya Allah, help us, protect us from putting haram into our mouths, Ya Allah. Protect us from interest, protect us from gambling, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, protect us from the nightlife and the clubs, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, protect us from any form of your anger, Ya Allah. We don't want your anger, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, never roast us in the fire of Jahannam, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, never roast us in the fire of Jahannam, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, we will never be able to even bear even a second in the fire, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, protect us. Ya Allah, write our name tonight from amongst those who are free from the fire of Jahannam, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, write our names from amongst those who are free from the fire of Jahannam, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, grant us Jannah without reckoning, Ya Allah. If you are to take account of our deeds, we are too embarrassed of what we've done, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, we are too embarrassed of what we have done. Ya Allah, don't look at our deeds. Ya Allah, forgive us without reckoning. Ya Allah, forgive us without reckoning. Ya Allah, forgive us without reckoning. Ya Allah, tonight you forgive so many people. Ya Allah, forgive us. Ya Allah, grant us Jannah without Hisab, without Kitab. Protect us from Jahannam, Ya Allah. Join our families with us, Ya Allah. Join all our Ummah with us, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, forgive the Ummah of Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Ya Allah, his concern was his Ummah, Ya Allah. We are part of that Ummah. Ya Allah, unite us, Ya Allah. Unite the ulama, Ya Allah. Unite the members of this ummah, Ya Allah. Help us love one another solely because we share the kalima, La ilaha illallah, Muhammadur Rasulullah. Ya Allah, we ask you tonight, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, we ask you tonight, Ya Allah, to make us from those whom you have accepted, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, the magicians of Musa alayhi salam prostrated once and you forgave them. 
We prostrate every day, Ya Allah, forgive us. <laughs> ya Allah, the magicians prostrated once for you, Ya Allah, you forgave them. Ya Allah, we prostrate every day, Ya Allah, forgive us. Ya Allah, accept our prostration, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, we have never, ever, ever made sujood to anyone but you. Ya Allah, forgive us. Ya Allah, we have never worshipped anyone but you. Ya Allah, forgive us. Ya Allah. Ya Allah, you are the most generous. We are pleading with you, Ya Allah. We know you are generous, Ya Allah. You are the most generous and we are asking the most generous, Ya Allah. We know you will grant us. Ya Allah, we've raised our hands for you, Ya Allah. Amongst us, there are men, there are women. They are the old, they are the young, they are the sickly, Ya Allah. They are the healthy, Ya Allah. We know you will answer our dua. Ya Allah, save us from the fire of Jahannam, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, grant us the intercession of Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, we ask you to protect the Muslim ummah, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, we have had a beautiful, blessed month, Ya Allah, accepted from us, Ya Allah. Grant us sincerity in our deeds. Ya Allah, strengthen us so we can change our lives to please you, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, strengthen us so we can change our lives to please you. Ya Allah, we know that this worldly life is a few years. Ya Allah, we know that no matter how healthy we are today, we have to die today or tomorrow. Ya Allah, we know that no matter how wealthy we are, we still have to return to you, Ya Allah. So help us become conscious of it and prepare for the day, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, help us be steadfast. Ya Allah, help us substitute the music we have with the Quran, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, help us substitute that which is detrimental for our spirituality with that which is beneficial, Ya Allah. Ya Allah, we ask you all the goodness that Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam has asked you. And we seek protection from all the evil that Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam has sought protection from. Anta al-musta'an alayka al-balaag wa la hawla wa la quwata illa billahi al-ali al-azim. Rabbana taqabbal minna innaka anta al-sami'u al-alim wa tub alayna innaka anta al-tawwabu al-rahim. اللهم إنا نعوذ برضاك من سخطك وبمعافاتك من عقوبتك وبك منك لا نحصي ثناء عليك أنت كما أثنيت على نفسك اللهم صل على نبينا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه وسلم سبحان ربك رب العزة عما يصفون وسلام على المرسلين والحمد لله رب العالمين مولا يا سلي بسلم دائما نبادا ألا هابي بك خير الخلق قل